All right, sunshine, out. You can't squat here. Drink it up. It'll warm you. They're sending someone as soon as they can, a Mrs. Khan. Someone is coming who can talk to you. Who knows your language. Where should you wait? Try and find somewhere comfortable. Here, you have to be joking. Come on, then. It's going to be one of those days. Going to be, it already is. You've got another one waiting outside. Another what? Vagrant. Does she look like a vagrant? She's lost. On a roundabout in a summer dress at six o'clock in the morning. How old would you say she was? Thirteen. Older than that, surely. If that. You're next. It's like a dentist. At least your one speaks. Hi. Come on, son. She looks cold. She's used to the sun, isn't she? That wasn't meant to be unkind. I just meant what I said. In you go. Hello. Morning, Bill. Wash day. Dirty little... You can have a shot at ours while you're at it. Thank you very much. Chris is in his office if you want to. Hello. No use. Doesn't speak English. Doesn't speak at all. Oh, one of those. I think the child is shocked. We must be patient. Uh, can you? Chalier? Looks like you'll have another one before the day's out. Boy, white. Picked up Dossing in Squatters Row. I don't want to know. Fine, because he won't give his name. We're bound to find out sooner or later. Like saying you're going to die sooner or later, isn't it? All right, Socrates. Your home isn't that bad, is it? Mm -hmm. What school do you go to? Right, we'll have to get you taken into care. Can't do that. Oh, yes, I can. You're not new, you know. We have kids like you coming in here all the time. There's nothing new about you. You'll be taken from here to a reception home where you will temporarily reside. You'll be given a free bed, free food, soap and hot water. Just like a stately home. No hooks, no strings. Come or go as you please. <laughs> a fantasy, isn't it? You will sleep here, girl, but it's been a little while. When your mother and father will know you, there's no problem to be afraid. Now we'll watch you. She can borrow this. Now, what did you bring for me? It's a little bit. Poor child. She's not been here long, I think. It can be most confusing for a young girl to be suddenly in a different land. Mr. Langley's waiting for you downstairs. Soon, Betty, ye pain lo. Tum kaha ja thi, Betty? Bole, I ask her, where are you going? But she doesn't answer me. But lao, tum kaun hai? Tumra naam kya hai? Tum kaha se aaye ho? Kaha ja rahi ho? Haan, haan? Hai Pakistan ja rahi ho. Nahi, wo to jahan se tum aaye ho, Betty. मैं उधर ही वापस जा रही हूँ। मैं वापस पाकिस्तान जा रही हूँ। What did she say? She says that she's going back to Pakistan. A sort of illegal emigrant. Perhaps. Makes a change. It's not humorous, Mr. Langley. No, I know, but it does have its funny side. Not for the child, I think. I will, of course, make a full report. She's very young, Mr. Langley. Perhaps she's only recently arrived with her parents. Or perhaps she's a fiancé. I do understand, Mrs. Khan. It's not just that she's a long way from home. This is like a different world. She's young and afraid. She's bewildered. Yes, thank you. Wendy. 
You can always call on me. Thank you, Mrs. Gunn. Of course, if she came here with her family, they will be looking for her. They will have notified the authorities. They may not be here officially. In that case, it will be more difficult for them to go to the police, you understand? I understand. Come on. Just take your finger out for a minute. Where's your mummy and daddy, then? She can't understand you, Jackie. She can't understand English. Haven't you got a home to go to? I'm going home tomorrow, aren't I, miss? Yeah, now eat your food and leave her alone. Come on, Sarah. Eat up, there's good girl. Take it out for a minute. Come on, you must eat it all up. That's enough. But she hit me. Sarah, it's all right. I'm sure she'd say she was sorry if she could. But why can't she then? Because she doesn't speak English. She's a bleeding packy, isn't she? She's from Pakistan, yes, but I see no sign of blood. <laughs> there, you see, she's saying she's sorry. Jackie. Room for another one? There's a place at Annie's table, but I don't guarantee there's any food left. Wendy's talking nicely to Mrs. W. Oh, that'll make a change. She's done nothing but snap recently. But Toby. Over here. Your food will be here in a minute. Thanks. Hi. Hello. I'm Annie. Do you know each other? We were both at the police station this morning. Were we? She doesn't speak English. I understood. Come on, just have a good Come on. Okay. Thanks. Oh, oh, Wendy, you won't forget there's another bed to be made up, will you? We stripped down the one in the sports I know. Well, I only said... What's your name? I've possibly been trying to find that out all morning. I'm hardly likely to divulge the information of a meat and two veg now, am I? Why won't you? What's in a name? A rose by any other name would smell as sweet. Why do you want to know? It's all one to me. I'm sorry. Have it your way. This is Jackie. Jackie? Hello. And this is Sarah. Sarah? And this is another of the names. Can I have a word? I'm just going up to do this bed. Won't take more than a minute. I can't do everything. Yes? Shut the door. Look, I'm just going up to bed. Shut now. the door. This has got to stop. What? You know what. Apart from anything else, it's not good for the children. What isn't good for the children? Your emotional state. Look, we do have private lives, too. And yours is becoming a bit of a bore. I'd be grateful if you get a grip on yourself. Do the job you're paid to do. Anything else? Right. We've got half an hour. Your son is at school. We're married. Everything's legal. Are oh, you on a diet, all right, you? Chris! What? I'm just gonna have a nice cup of coffee and a quick read. And I run a poor third. Oh well. Oh. Make your own. Gone off the whole idea anyway.
You don't speak Urdu, do you? Mm. You do? Do what? Speak Urdu. What are you talking about? Stupid substantive. Oh. I just lost my temper. Who is? Wendy. Either she's not here or when she is, she's moping around, being irritable. All right. Sorry. Are you still seeing, um... Peter Judd. Who's going away. End of the week, I gather. Wolverhampton, I think. Rather liked him. Did you? Mm. Reminded me of you. When you were young. Maybe that's why she likes Robert. Maybe she could have an affair with him. Who? Robert? Mm, I'm sure you wouldn't mind. Anything in this? North Sea Oil, the pound, missing aristocrat, nothing new. Let's go to bed. I'm just on call. The girl we got doesn't speak any English. They picked her up on a roundabout. What sort of roundabout? A round one, I suppose. No, I mean a fun fair or a... Oh, no, 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 on the bypass. Actually, we don't know. She doesn't speak fluent English. She just hasn't spoken it to us. So you don't know anything about her? According to Mrs Khan, she said she was going back to Pakistan. Maybe she was just waiting for a passing jumbo. Pat. What? <laughs> no, I mean the, the jet guy, not the animal. <laughs> she just said, I'm going back to Pakistan. Like a salmon being drawn back to its place of birth. I quite like washing up. Wonders you'll never see. The little... Sarah, why is she in? Don't ask me. I'll never know. Why are you? Vagrancy, they say. Oh, your parents will be worried. Come on. No, they won't. I don't know where to put anything. I'll put away. She's Sarah's house mother. Sarah? Well, I was wondering. Sarah's entire family was killed. Mum, Dad, two brothers and the dog. Well, how? Car crash. She didn't want to go, just going to the park to take the dog for a walk. She stayed behind to play at a friend's house. They got into their car, drove to the end of the road, and went straight into the back of a lorry. Poor Sarah. And what will happen to her? Foster parents, if she's lucky. And if not? She'll be in care. And what will happen to me? That depends on you. We'll find out about you sooner or later. Maybe. Go on, get out. I'm going to play a again. <sighs>
Do you want to play? Indra. Philip. You're spoiling us with all your help. May as well. It must be such a muddle for her, not knowing what's being said. You nearly finished. We should have to take him on the star. Oh, you do get heavy. Hello, Sarah. You made a friend for life. Now, what was I doing? Oh. Packing for Jackie. Annie, can we go out? If you'd like to. For a walk? You want to go for a walk? Well, don't let her cross any roads. Don't go near the river and don't let her... We'll be careful. Will you take her with you? Of course. Come on. Come on. <laughs> Watch it. <laughs> Cool. <laughs> Hold on tight. <laughs> this is the way. The lady right. The lady right. The lady. Leaves me free to get on anyway. Wendy out again. Don't know where she is. Right, Jackie. I don't think she's well, you know. Wendy. Do you mean they don't know where you are? Getting the sack's going to be catching. You have to talk. So, we're talking. I've got a job. I'm going to Wolverhampton. And us? Sorry. I'll get a job in Wolverhampton. It's a rotten climate. Peter, please. I'm sorry. I thought... I don't care what you thought! I'm sorry. Sorry. about the same things. I know all that. It's 
It's just that I never envisaged a lifetime, you know. Make it sound like a prison sentence. I mean, all the Hampton, it's on a train line. Intercity, heart to heart. Salt water, bad for the complexion. When are you going? Sunday afternoon. Now be a good girl and help your mum. And tell her you've learnt to do your own laces. Mrs Khan's coming back this evening to see the Pakistani girl. She seems to be getting on very well with the new lad. Everyone seems to be getting on well with the new lad. No one's been able to find out anything yet? No, except for Sarah. Sarah? She says his name's Philip, but it's a secret. And she's going to marry him when she grows up. Good for Sarah. 45, 46, 47, 48, 49, 50. Coming. Ready or not? No, no, Indra. I'm supposed to find you. I got you. <laughs> <laughs> no more. No more. Tickle Indra. No, Indra. No. Maaf kijiye. Mujhe pata nahi tha tum kya khel rahe the. Baby. Ba baby. Baby. Mother. Baby. Mother. Baby. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Your mother. Your mother. Where? Where's your mother? Where? Mary Ma, Pakistan. At least yours is somewhere in the world. My mother is dead. My father is dead too. I don't think anyone knows that yet. He killed him. I shot him. My father is dead. Goes the weasel. So, it's goodbye. I'm not going till Sunday. No? And why are you packing now? See you in Wolverhampton. He didn't touch her, you know. She just came round that corner and saw him and started screaming. Sammy, did the nasty little girl frighten you then? Oh, come on. Where the hell have you been? Wendy, I'm talking to you. Come into the office. Please.
can't go on, you know. Sorry. Peter? Do you want to tell me about it? Just go out when you feel like it. <sighs> right. Well, let me tell you something. At the moment, you're selling us short. Annie has had to cover for you all day and yesterday, and you can't just wander off whenever you feel like it. So either you pack your bags now and go off to Wolverhampton with Loverboy, or you accept the responsibilities of your job in this house and of the children in it. So, which is it to be? <laughs> Annie, go after all. You put her somewhere, anywhere, away from the children. Take her up to the flat. Right, but there's something you've got to know. The new boy, the Pakistani girl and Sarah, went out for a walk at two, and they're still not back. Stuart's gone to look. In the car, sir. No, silly. But I do live in a great big house, surrounded by trees. And a river runs right through the grounds. And beyond the trees, there are hills and mountains as far as the eye can see. With your mummy and daddy? No. Why not? I told you. I'm like you. We haven't got a mummy and daddy. But we'll be all right, won't we? Mm. Want to play a game? No. <laughs> yes, you do. <laughs> what do you want, then? <laughs> More story. What about? The <laughs> house in the tree. OK. Come on. <laughs> Sit down. Uh. In the grounds near my house. There's a tree house. It was built for my brother when he was little. And if you climb up into the tree house, you can see right the way down the path to the river. Like this one? Yeah. My father fishes there. Hey! We've been looking for you. Well, come on. It's nearly tea time. Sorry. We... I didn't realize it was so late. She all right? She saw a dog. I think you must have reminded her of. Well, you're all right now, Sarah, aren't you? I better. Drink your coffee. I feel a bit sick. What about it? I can't let him go. I can't. I know I'm behaving, but I can't. I'm sorry. He said, he said, I must go. Not yet. You protecting me or the household? Neither. Finish your coffee. Will he sack me? Who, oh, Chris? I don't know. I shouldn't think so. He doesn't want to. I'm sorry. It must be so embarrassing for you. Oh, no, of course not. You're always so cool. I don't know. I know that he... Peter. Well, I can't let him go. Him? Or someone? Him! And Biscuit. Most of us need someone, I suppose. No, not like that. I don't mean that. What have we got? Relating, relationships. I don't know. Part of you always wants what you haven't got anyway. You? Anyone. All of us. All those sad children who come and go. They're not. Well, to me, they are. I'm not part of it, Wendy. Sad children. Not wanting to feel completely alone. Not to feel outside. It's not really like that, Pat. No? Oh, most of them are tough. Look at Bill. He's a product of such a place. He's OK. You're not. I'm in love. Oh, come on. You want what you can't have. You can't make someone love you. I know, I know. Then be grateful, girl, for what you've had. And stop looking back. I remember. What? Nothing. Just something I did to someone once. 
Do you want me to leave you alone with her? I don't think it's going to make much difference if she's not going to speak. She seems to be getting on well with a boy who arrived here the same day as she did. I wonder if... He speaks Hindi? No, but they found some way of communicating. Perhaps I could see this boy. I'll get Stuart to fetch him. Then the big bad frog jumped out from behind the bushes. Oh. Yeah. Turned to the princess and said... What are you doing? Finish it later, all right? Come on. Come on, Sarah. Oh, she really did it. Right. Come on. Oh, I lost my board again. Sarah says Philip lives in a house up a tree. Right. And his Come daddy on, goes fishing. It's my daddy. Hey, look at Good indeed. He's also very rich and he's been to the palace. Bucky and Crystal are full of them. I don't want to go here. I don't have any meaning. I don't want to go here. Then you can tell me what I want to go here. Come in. She says she does not want him here. Philip, you go here. Go here. Go here. Indra. Whatever you have done, they will go away. Go, Philip. Go. What is she saying? She says Philip must go away from here. He must go. Whatever he has done, they will find out. Do you understand this? No. You say her name is Indira? Yes. Is that all you know? Well, neither of us speak each other's language. Her names are about as far as we could get. Say to her that she must tell you where she is from. That you only want to help. My dear young man, I've been saying that for a long time, you know. Say to her that I wanted to tell you. Very well. Ye bolta hai ke tumhe batlana parega ke tum kaha se ho. Yes, Indra. You must. You cannot stay here. Philip, tumhe pata hai hum dono ek se hai. Hamare paas jaane ke liye koi jagah nahi hai. Aaste, aaste. Dekho, dheere bolo. I'm sorry. I say to her, she must speak more slowly. मैंने कहा फिलिप और मैं दोनों एक से है। She says Philip, you and she are both alike, you know. हमारे पास जाने के लिए कोई जगह नहीं है, कोई जगह नहीं। She says you both have no way you can go to. You are both, how you say, not placed. How does she know so much about you, if neither of you can speak to each other? I really don't know. What is it she knows, Philip? Well, why don't you ask her, Mr. Langley? Mrs. Khan? Tum Philip ka baare mein kya jante ho, Indira? Hame ab bolo. She knows my name. That's all. Push. Why are you sad? That's my line. You work here? Yes. Well, I wasn't sure. I thought you might... What is it that you call us? One of the inmates. Flattery will get you practically anywhere. Flattery? To be in care, I'd have to be much younger. Oh, I didn't know there was an age limit. I've spoiled it. It isn't bad crying. My mother never cried. Ever. No matter what he did to her, she never cried. And one night she died. They say she killed herself. Maybe if she cried, she'd be alive today. When did she kill herself? Well, not long. I'm sorry. Oh, I was at school. I went home for the funeral. Didn't go back. To school? I set out to. Needed time to think. We can help you, you know. The welfare state where everyone fares well. I don't think you can help me. You could give us a chance. Is it a man? What? That you cry about. Is it a man? I suppose so. It's difficult to say. 
Are you a child? It doesn't mean much age, does it, after a certain point? It's more what happens to you. The important thing is not to regret what you've done. What have you done? Not just yet. Unless I have to. No. I'll stop out a bit longer then. Aren't you cold? Oh, no. It's much warmer down here than it is in Scotland. One to you. I'll take the high road and you'll take the low but I'll be in Scotland for you. I'm sorry to disturb you. One of the kids has gone missing. Chris! Won't be a minute. Here's up. Would you like a cup of tea? No, I'd better get down. Well, what's Ron's gone? Don't think you know him, really. He's only just arrived. I try not to know any of them. Oh, no. What? New kid, Philip. He's done a bunk. He's taking his guitar and his sleeping bag. I'll just snatch a quick cup of tea. I'll be right down. <coughs> oh, and uh, just so you don't hit the roof. There are no papers this morning. Papers weren't delivered. Oh, ours were. It's him, isn't it? Yeah, I think it is. More milk. Winston spilled half a pint. I'll take it. You look at this. What? I knew there was something. Sir James's body was recovered from the river that runs through his estate near Peebles. Police statement says that he's been shot cleanly once through the head. Sir James, who was knighted in the 1974 birthday honours list for his services to commerce, leaves four children, the youngest of... All it says is the police are looking for him. And his father's been murdered. They don't connect with two. No, but... Um, I've got to do the school run. Yeah, all right, Bill. You told the police? Yes, yes. Didn't you say the Pakistani girls seem to know something? Yeah, I've also got Mrs Khan coming in. See if we can't get something more out of her. I wonder when he did leave. Could be any time. Or it's just the house opposite. It's got its papers. It's sticking out the door. <laughs> I mean, he couldn't leave without the times to read on the journey. Well, if he's on the run, he might want to know what's been said. He could have bought a paper. He wasn't broke when he came in here. Unless he hoped to stop us reading it. Give himself a bit more time. I liked him. So did I. He helped with the washing up. All it says is that the police want to find him. And, I mean, what was he doing right up in Scotland one minute and right down in London the next? He may not have been up in Scotland. It's only what the paper says. How did he get here? He probably hitched a lift, or several. That means the drivers will identify him. I just think he ought to have the right to tell his own story. He will have. No, oh, we're telling it for him. Telephone for you, Wendy. Peter. Oh. Tea? Yeah, lovely. I thought that Peter was leaving. Sunday, Wendy says. Good. She can do better than that. You and she had looked good together. Uh, oh, I was in the middle of the... You are wicked. I'm sorry. I... She does not trust me, you know. Actually, at the moment, I'm far more concerned about him. She asks what will happen to him. Well, you... So, you have been deceiving us. Please? I don't know. Please? He'll be questioned. 
Philip? You are a very bad girl. Uh, I uh, had to uh, hide. From whom? I not like. I want home. But this is your home. How long have you been here? But you do speak English. Uh, not so very. I learn Hyderabad. Philip, he told things. He think I no understand. He is not bad. He good. Um. मैं कितना चाहती हूँ कि उसको सब कुछ बता दूँ लेकिन नहीं बताया क्योंकि उसने मेरे को जो नहीं बताना था बताया she says she wanted to tell him all about herself but didn't because he had told her so much he should not have done please indira tell us what he said where are you living in england child uncle bradford and what are you doing here in london i uh, seek brother i uh, want to go pakistan but why i not like here i am afraid but when you have settled are you to marry yes is that what you're afraid of no it is a uh, british M my uncle uh, he say you not want us here where is your brother I not know. Uh, London. Uh, he a uh, work. Um, eating. Uh, uh, me. But I can't even get a job. I'm. 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 तुम्हारा भाई को जरूर ढूंढ लेंगे जिस वक्त तक तुम यहाँ खुश रहोगे फिलिप प्लीज इंदिरा टेल अस व्हाट ही टोल्ड यू वी वांट टू हेल्प हिम टू ही नो टेल मी अ सीक्रेट आई विल नो टेल नॉट इवन टू हेल्प हिम नो मेरी नहीं है देने के लिए शी सेज it is not hers to give you what going out now i've got to annie why he's going today is he expecting you to call It wasn't going till Sunday, but he's going today. Use your sense, girl. He's leaving early just to avoid this. Wendy, it's over. Stop chasing him. I'm not chasing him. I just want to say thank you and goodbye. All right. What was that about? Sorry, Chris. I just got into a bit of an argument. With Wendy. Yeah. Where is she now? Gone with the provisions list. She won't be long. She'd better not be. Sarah? Sarah? What are you looking at? Nothing. Do you want to come and help me? What is it? I want Philip. Don't you want to come with me? You were shouting. When? Now. I wasn't shouting. I was just... Come on. I expect Mrs Wilson might have a biscuit if we ask her. Where is he? We don't know. But I'm sure he'll be back soon. You like him, don't you? Why? Does he tell you stories? What about? Things. And he sings songs. Yeah. And he come back soon. I'm sure he will. No. You gave me a start. He not come back. 
Nonsense, child. Of course he will. No. He run. Keep run. Philip? Run. Hi. Looking for me? No. I'm about the only one who isn't. Where are you going? Well, don't let me detain you. What are you doing here? I'm on the run, I suppose. Or rather, I was. And now? I'm not anymore. I can't think where to hide. I don't even want to hide. Not forever. I like people. They only want to help you. I told you last night I'm past help. Besides, they'll have got it out of Indra by now. Indra? Yes. She speaks English. Just what we hadn't bargained for. I'm sure of it. Look, if you want to go. Go? You were in a hurry. Yes. Don't let me stop you. It was a silly hurry. Look, I'll see myself back. It'll be easier going to the house than the police station. No. I will go back, honestly. I'll go with you. Your engagement. Can wait. I borrowed some newspapers. I've still got them. Mrs. Wilson had one. It's funny. Doesn't sound at all like it was. I'm sure it's wrong to kill people. I'm sure it is. I'm sure it is. Did you? Oh, yes. I took a rifle from the gun room. I waited in the treehouse. He was fishing. He taught me how to shoot. I got him in one. But why? When my mother died, I went home for the funeral. How did she die? He killed her. What? He killed her. Oh, she crashed a car like Sarah's parents. It was an accident or suicide, they said. But it wasn't either, I knew. I was the only one left, you see. My brothers and my sister were away from home. But I was there every holiday. I used to hear the rows. She used to get drunk, you know. It wasn't an accident. He made her. Then at the funeral, he was crying. I couldn't stand that. I knew then what I would do. And I don't regret it. I'll take you back. 